So this is the installation video of the single motor height adjustable desk which you purchased from Jin office. So first we have removed all the parts from the box. Okay. So these are all the parts. Now we will start with the step one. So the first step we have to fit the crossbar. Okay. So this is the crossbar. You have to loosen these two screws. So once you have loosened the screw, this crossbar is with, with adjustable. So you have to remove this part. Okay. Put the screws here. There will be two screws here. And there will be two screws here. These are the four screws which will be fitted. So now we have fitted the crossbar. Okay. While fitting the crossbar, make sure that this part is close to the motor. So accordingly you can fit the crossbar. The screws are drilled and the screws are drilled. Now you can also adjust the width of the table. Adjust the width of the See, this way you can adjust the width of the table. And after adjusting the width, you can tight this Allen key so that the width gets fixed. So now we'll put the wings of the desk. So this is the wing. And with this screw and Allen key, you will fit it on this side. It will be put in the hole. Similarly, will happen on this side as well. So now the wings have been fixed. Now we will attach the adapter holder here. So the adapter holder will come here. Okay. And where the adapter will be put. Now we will rotate the desk so that we can put the base of the table. So now we will put the base of the table. There are four screws to be put to fix to the base. These are the four screws. And similar on the other side as well. These are the foot levelers. You can adjust the foot leveler by rotating it. These are the foot levelers. You can put it in and adjust the height if you want if there is some uneven surface. Once the base is fitted then again you can make the table straight. So now we will put the sink rod. Uh, but before putting the sink rod try to make the desk to the maximum width. Okay. Now put the sink rod first on this side. So first loosen this. Okay, so that this part comes out. Put it little out, then again tighten it. Now this black part, which is there, should completely go inside. You have to rotate it a little bit. So once you have tightened it, now you have to put this part inside and this black part should go completely inside. You have to rotate it a little bit and tighten it. So the black part will touch here. The black part will touch here and sometimes if there's some issue, you can also use a lubricant or something. We'll again try to do it. See that way it goes easily. Okay. And, and shake a little bit. So that it can go completely inside. Again showing you. Yeah, it got fitted. Now again loosen this knob. Okay. And then hold it from this side. And put it on the other side. It goes completely inside. And then again tighten it. So that way your crossbar is completely installed. Okay, then we'll move on to the next step. So now we'll show you the wiring, how it will work. So there's a wire from the motor, which will get connected to the control panel. Okay. After the control panel, this wire will get connected to the power cord. And the power cord, there'll be a wire from the power cord, which will directly go into the plug. So that way your desk will be completely installed with the frame. And then you're, then you're ready to start. Now if you want to install the tabletop, invert the particular frame so that it's upside down and put the screws from here which will directly go into the tabletop. So that way the frame will get attached to the tabletop. And now this control panel which is there, this control panel will come under the tabletop. So there are screw holes which are there which will pass through this and get connected to the tabletop. So that way the desk installation will be complete.